Hi, well I'm now here with Sebastian from JVC Pro and they, they brought along a very interesting piece of kit called a 2D to 3D converter that actually converts 2D footage into 3D but actually in real time as well. So can you tell me a bit more about this Sebastian? Yeah, absolutely. So what we have is the IF 2D 3D. This IF 2D 3D converts 2D images into stereo images. So we, it really is actually just aimed at converting archives or actually just fitting into a, a 3D workflow where you don't necessarily actually just have um, a stereoscopic rig everywhere. So if you actually just end up, let's say, with uh, two or three stereoscopic cameras and you want to actually just have one dangling on cables or something where you can't actually just put a stereo camera, you can then convert that one feed from a, um, a single camera to a stereo. The way we actually just display this on the screen or what the box actually just gives you is one of the many different formats for 3D. So we're looking at things like side-by-side, side, above and below checkerboards, and so on. Or into those. Um, what the box is actually just doing is turning that 2D feed into a side-by-side, side, like you can see here. And the screen, which is a GD46310, actually just turns this into a stereo. This is, by the way, this isn't a regular plasma TV. This is a professional that's, monitor. That's correct. So this actually just turns it into a stereo system, like this. This is a passive display, which is based on um, those glasses, those glasses yeah. which is basically, <laughs> exactly. Um, like the real D-type. The real D-type, which is effectively based on polarized um, system. So it's a circular polarized. There's a filter on the screen itself, which actually just polarized every other line into one way or the other, fitting into one eye or the other. So as you actually just put the glasses, you get a stereo into your eyes. So this, this will, it won't, uh, this is only positive 3D, it's only 3D that goes into the screen, right? That's correct, Okay. Yes. And I understand that it was used uh, during the World Cup or something where it was actually being filmed in 3D, but they needed to cut to another source and this, exactly. this helped in between. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, this is a sort of box that actually just fits in this sort of uh, environment where you can't necessarily actually just have a stereo rig in place for certain shots. I mean, in the World Cup, for instance, having cameras actually just rolling on cables, you couldn't actually just fit a stereo rig on there, so you had a single camera, and the output was then actually just converted to stereo. Okay. So what kind of interest are you having with this? So this is, I mean, it's quite expensive, isn't it? This is for professional broadcasting use, right? How much is this? That's £25,000. Okay, so this is, this is a pure professional. It's not something you have in your home to convert Joe's Bond to 3D or anything Absolutely. like that. Okay, well that's really, really interesting and um, I've always been a bit sort of sceptical about conversion and this is a lot better than some of the other examples I saw that were actually built into the television, but obviously it's a professional product, it's going to be, have a, a higher standard of conversion. So uh, thank you so much for showing me today. You're welcome.